went into your uh, your hot start to this game, you you and the defense came out and seemed to hold up one of the top offenses of the country to little points. Well, we came out just trying to play football like we have since we were young. That's the whole. That's the reason everybody comes out here. Everybody from all around the country comes out to play football. And that's what we came out to do. Try our hardest, punch them in the mouth from the get go. That's, that's what we try to do. That's pit defense. Brandon, after the way things unfolded last week, how did you, how would you assess your team's fight and their ability to bounce back throughout maybe this week's practices and then leading into today? Our team's fight's impeccable. It's hard. It's hard to find. It's hard to find some a team with fight like we have. Every day we attack. Every day like it's our last. Like it's our last snap. We make sure we come in every day prepared, trying to attack the day as best we can. The pass interference penalty that was called on you. How, can you break that play down? Um. It was just, it was just a little under under route. Uh, I got to do a better job making sure. Obviously, I get my hands a little bit more hidden, I guess you could say. Uh, I didn't think I grabbed him, but at the end of the day, uh, referee made the call, and that's what we go with. Usually, Florida State scores a lot more points in 24. Do you guys, what positive do you take out of this game because you held know, the number four team down pretty much? Like I said, we just we trying to play every snap like it's our last. We're not worried about the one before. We're not the worried about the next one. We're worried about the snap we're at right now. So that's the, that's kind of the mentality we took this entire week. How we've been attacking the week. How we've been attacking each play, and we need to continue doing that in order to improve our game every step of the way. Can you recall the fourth down stop you had where they, they were trying to go for it in the red zone? You had the big tackle to stop it. Yeah, that's that's an, that's a defensive play. That's not that's not just me. That's the front. That's the front seven. That's the back four. That's pit defense. That's pit defense as a whole. That's us flying to the ball, getting there, everybody doing their job, making sure we play like pit. Anything else for Brandon? Could you feel momentum shift after that unsportsmanlike? Like they really tipped this game. Um, it's hard to say. Like I guess you like on the field, especially like you're so focused, it's hard to really think about momentum at some points. Um, we're just so, like I mean, you guys are gonna get tired of hearing me say it. We're, like every play is our last. We're focused on that next play. So, however, we just come out, attack that play, and we go from there. When uh, Gavin got called for the unsportsman, like, did you have a vantage point on what happened, or maybe what I was said? I think we've gotten into that subject enough. We've had at least two prior people address it, and I don't think we need to address it anymore. Sure, thank you, Drew. Anything else? Brandon, um, how, how would you evaluate your season so far, and uh, what have you done well? What are you looking to work on going forward? Uh, are you talking about? That's, you're talking about the team, correct? Yeah, um, as a team, I feel like we've grown a lot since the start of the season. Um, we've grown every every day, every week. Um, we have a young squad. We have a lot of guys that are stepping into roles that they haven't stepped in before. And we've obviously had some growing pains, but that's not to say that our season is a failure because it's not. Every day we attack, like, it, like I said, like it's our last. And we continue to do that day in and day out. People are going to try and address the fact that like we're out of bowl contention, but to be honest, we we're playing we're playing to play Syracuse. We're going we're going forward one step at a time, and we need to improve one step at a time and continue to pl improve and play pit football like we can and like we should. And to that point, do you think that can lay the foundation? Like every, every practice lays the foundation going forward. Right? Absolutely, every not even just every practice, every rep, every minute you're in meetings. Every little detail you do outside the facility and inside the facility, that's what lays the foundation for every game. Pat noted, final one? Pat noted that uh, they wanted to get you and Shane like kind of the similar amount of snaps at middle linebacker. How have you grown this year to be one of those guys that they call upon at big moments? Uh, I think that's a testament to our team as a whole. Uh, just every, everybody making sure they bring everybody along because everybody's going to have a bad day. Everybody's going to have a bad play. At the end of the day, it's. It's our job as brothers to make sure we drag, we drag you out of that hole that you put yourself in, if you put yourself in one, and continue to press on. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, you everyone. Thank you.